uh, we're looking into the death of a woman named Anna Garcia. And so we look at the diseases that she had um, and also some other things that were going on in her life um, right before her untimely death. We have um, a former uh, MHS student here um, telling us a little bit about his career as a phlebotomist and how it, um, it fits into the careers that we're studying in our class principles of biomedical science. So we had um, the crime scene tech, um, tech from uh, Marshalltown Police Department come in, Courtney Watson, and she told us a little bit about how to process a crime scene. And we will continue to have other guests as they fit in with our curriculum, and um, it's a good place to learn a little bit more and do some hands-on activities. Um, we're giving a little insight into the world of phlebotomy to high school students. Um, get them, uh, I believe in this class, is uh, an idea into different careers and see if that's something that, uh, that they'd like to do. Um, so I'm kind of giving them an overview of what I do um, and I give them a chance to try to draw a little blood on the fake arm here and uh, see if that's something that might spark interest in a career they might want to choose. So. I think it gives the students a more real world idea of what the career is versus just reading about it on the internet and looking at it that way. They get to hear about what a day in the life really is and they get to try some things a little bit more than just writing and reading, you know, reading and writing about it. Uh, I think this is uh, great. I, I wish we had this when I was here. This seems amazing. Uh, I wish uh, we could have got a little more insight, you know, growing up back then uh, to what there is out there. And I, I think it's a great program. And uh, like I said, I, I wish we had this growing up. It would have been very helpful. So uh, I think what they're doing is great.